Hello my friends and welcome to a new episode of the Chess of Obscurity. This time we are looking at the Hudson Best Collection. <clears throat> and of course this is a hack of many Hudson games put together on one disc. In this case, we got Load Runner, Star Soldier, Bonk's Adventure, Adventure Island, Bomberman Jetters, Dream Mix TV, Bonk's Adventure, yeah, Adventure Island, Bomber and Jetters, Dream Mix TV World Fighters. So, I mean, most of you know about Bomber and Jetters, Ta Takahashi Mijin is translated as Adventure Island, PC Genjin is Bonk's Adventure. Star Soldier, Low Runner, Bomberman Kart DX, World Fighters, or Dream Mix TV World Fighters, and then Bomberman Jetter. So we're gonna look at the one that strangely never made out over here, which is Dream Mix TV World Fighters. You're probably wondering why? Well, since it is make a man well you'll see why and this is brought to us by Hudson's Hops of 2003 so it's gonna require a memory card so yes we are <laughs> Good evening, baby. Where's the waiters? Dreamix TV World Fighters, as they say. I remember some time back, this was like. This was mentioned to me. I forgot who mentioned it to me. Save load road. Save. Hi, Mr. Kyo, 
番組では各界のスターをお招きしてこの番組で用意した全6ステージにチャレンジしていただきますルールは簡単相手を攻撃してライフを飛ばしライフをエンプティーにしたらさらに攻撃<笑>相手をダウンさせて体間を奪い取れば勝ち<笑>どんなステージが用意されているかは挑戦者次第はてさてどうなることやらはいそういうわけで今日の挑戦者はこの方ですああそうあん It's like Smash TV So we got This is from Baseball Simon Twin B. I don't know who this is. This is from Beyblade, Python. This is Prime from,、um, you know, Transformers. I don't know who the hell this is. Bomberman, of course. I forgot who the hell this is. Master Higgins. Oh, we got some weird shit going on. So let's make it stupidly weird by, well, playing as Twin B. Make it play as Twin B, Twin B, Twin B. I don't know who Black is, but we're going with Twin B. I'm going into the shit blind. It plays like、um, Smash. So. No time, just basically beat the living shit out of your opponent. That's all it's really about. Tyson from, from Beyblade. I feel better about myself. <laughs> The fuck, girl? And you fucking serious? And then you got, um. <laughs> when, you're, when you're 
upgrading up Master Higgins. I mean, come on. <laughs> it's like, um, yeah. Twimby is taking revenge against, um, what Master Higgins used to be. And then there's Bomber in. We're gonna call this Twimby's Revenge. For the honor of Konami. This is the most weirdest game I've ever played. <laughs> I love it for being I so stupidly weird. I love it for being so stupidly weird. Oh shit. Move, you dumb. Never mind. Hi, so you could do this stage, go stage, look to look at the Okrishmas. Channel, so no mama. For those who don't remember, Twin B did have an anime. And, and um. What the fuck is going on here? Like, we need to know about Convoy here. Don't know who Convoy is, that's, a, that's Prime's Japanese name. Com Convoy. <laughs> That's messed up when you're getting your ass kicked by Twin B. Or rather, the pilot of Twin B, and not just Twin B itself. Ready? Oh dear lord. <laughs> Now we're dealing with Belmont? This is <laughs> Twin B's revenge. Stage 
時六までクリアしてしまいよったかこうもあっさりと語られてしまっては番組のスポンサーに怒られてしまうえスポンサーに怒られちゃうんですかっていうことは番組終わっちゃうかもあれな初出演だったのにいきなり番組打ち切りなんていやいや打ち切りとまでは言ってないぞ<笑>そうですよねまだ最後のステージがありますもんねああ最後のステージ The strongest day. Hanako, you go over the thunder, that I got no jay. Motion, another is Kyle. I do a stage look at the Catholic Tatazo. A bright and a car. Kate at the most of the whole of the gun, not so. But I don't know more than what to see. The face of the Father, 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 the Oh, please don't become Dr. Wily. Please, for the love of God, don't become Dr. Wily. Shit. Where's Bravo Man when we need him? Oh. Oh. What in the blue bloody fuck? No, I don't remember. I've ever dealt with. And that's saying something. Oh, I miss games when they just didn't make no goddamn sense. Gemini lights do. Come on. Now. Um, yeah, I agree. I need Yeah. <laughs> 
Well, what can I say about this game except, um... If you ever play Smash, this game has much sense as Smash does. Which equals to none. Trust me, I have no idea why, but this game just exists. <laughs> That's all you need to know. There's just some games that just exist, just for the sake of existing. <laughs> Now, I'm not going to go through every one of the characters, but only the notable ones that most of you know about. Twin B, not many people know about Twin B. Twin B was brought over here as Stinger. As most do not know. But when it when it was brought out, yes, it was brought out under the name of Stinger. It wasn't brought out as Twin B. Then there was an anime. Very short-lived and very obscure. Almost as obscure as say Goemon. Because there was a Gambare Goemon anime, also otherwise known over here as Mystical Ninja. Um Takashi Meijin? Well we know it better as um Two. It, it's under two names. One is Adventure Island, the other one is Wonder Boy. Now, the difference between Wonder Boy and Adventure Island, the character really does have a name. Meiji Takashi. Over here, He's called Master Higgins. But, you know, over in Japan it's called Takashi Meijin's Bokenjima. No Bokenjima. Takashi Meijin no Bokenjima. Or Adventure Island. Of course, there have been like four on four on the NES, two on Super Nintendo, and two on Game Boy, and maybe one or two on Turbo Graphics. I might be wrong on that. Hudson the way it was. Your rank is B. Like we unlocked, we unlocked more characters. So, Solid Snake. Okay, we've unlocked Solid Snake. 
Let's go with another character not many people know of and That's Higgins. Or Takashi Mitchell. I believe there was a remaster of Adventure Island. I like hearing that. Wow, they just remembered it. The original Adventure Island piece just being remade like that. That's just. Wow. Yeah, that's the character's name Takahashi Meiji. Straight up transform prime. What the f <laughs> This is totally weird. <laughs> I like the to totally weird, but this is totally, totally weird. <laughs> We kind of already know what's happening. I probably know... I know that's Bomberman, but I can't for the life of me know who the hell that character is. I doubt it's Momotaro. But then again, it might be Momotaro. It's Momotaro. It's Momotaro. I, t I take it back. It's Momotaro because the, the peach. Peach boy. Peach boy. It it's coming back to me. Like, those who never played the Momotaro Densetsu games, they're trains. That's why I know about him. And that's why I just it just dawned on me like, oh hey. Uh. You know, for what this game was worth back in the day, this is pretty much Simon's first game before he ever was an I where ever was a concept into Smash. Oh, we are definitely in Momotaro world. Yeah. <laughs> 
Your hearts are mine. So basically, uh, <laughs> Takahashi is basically Igiari in the competition. He's like, objection, objection, objection. <laughs> He's constantly objecting everybody. So we got Koshien. Somebody from Bloody Roar. I can tell that's what it that's bloody roar. And then there's Tyson from Bayblade. Life is mine. Yeah. Hundred percent. You know, this is gonna get weird. This boss, is he supposed to be wily? be funny. You have the um, Snow Brothers in there. <laughs> you add the Snow Brothers like, what the Yeah. <laughs> 
Again, I kind of wish Bomber, oh, not Bomber Man, Bravo Man was in here. At least I survived the onslaught. This man has Igyari the competition. That's all you had to do. Point the finger. He did. another character. We're gonna see what that new character we've unlocked is. Manjimaru from Far East of Eden. I remember playing the arcade game. We're taking on Momotaro. Never heard of Far East of Eden. It was one of those very obscure arcade games by SNK. And then, of course, there was um, a Far East of Eden series. Yeah! <laughs> 
Those are wondering why it's like that, but it's, well, Manji. Manji Maru, you know, the Squash Cup is seen like backwards. Prime, what the hell? You're teaming up with Twin B. Okay. Wait, you're not really teaming up with Twin B, huh? Ah, the theme song, I'm listening to it. Like I said, you don't really hear the actual theme songs until you get to the middle part, like da 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 da. da. Like, oh, that's funny. <laughs> Not like I forget forget a title like Twin B, or even you know, Kabuki Clash Far East of Eden. Because I remember Deluxe did. A far, uh, far east of Eden Zero game on his channel. And I don't think he's actually ever done with it, or if he did, or if he is, I just hadn't seen it. After all, I'm basically playing catch up with certain walkthroughs that I, I'm gonna follow. And Deluxe, uh, I managed to basically play catch up with his. He also been doing Bujinkai Sword Master. Oh shit! following quite a bit of walkthroughs and let's plays. So I might just have to take a break from Who can play that game? Well, at least you're not like Pokemon Master who doesn't even want to throw a punch. You're not afraid to throw a punch.
I think covering these three characters really say something. I saw I say a character like this is like the Japanese version of RBI Baseball. That's why I remember. What the fuck are you doing, Bomberman? That's why I do remember. Some games I do remember more than most. And well, everybody remembers Bomb. This is totally stupid and I like it. Yes, the original Simon Bama was a redhead. For those that don't know, the Japanese version of Simon Belmont was a redhead. 
wherever you thought he was a blonde, that's a lie. <laughs> he has always been a redhead. <laughs> At least I know. Oh, hey, I can. I can use thunder. Final balls like this. Enjoyable, stupid, enjoyable, fun. To where I don't really have to explain jack the shit about the game. Just what I remember from certain other games. You know what? I'm okay with this.
like a final boss like this, it has to be enjoyable. It don't have to make sense. It just has to be enjoyable. That's all. Anvils. I'm pretty sure if this was really brought out over here, there'd be so many people just be freaked the fuck out like, who the hell are these people? Yes, you've never heard of Optimus Prime. You never heard of these characters? You never heard of Manjimaru? <laughs> you never heard of Twimpy? You never heard of Simon Belmont, the redhead? You never heard of Momotaro? Oh my gosh. You've never heard of Hudson Soft? You've never heard of Tonami? You've never heard of Koshien? Seriously. <laughs> Minds would get blown all the way out. <laughs> but I thought I would show this off because... There are some games that have been bugging me that I should do. With characters that I somehow remember. And most memorable is just... 
no. Manjimaru, Momotaro, Bomberman, Convoy, Simon Belmondo, Takashi Meijin, That kid from Beyblade. And, well, it's all way of stupid, and I, I totally like it. I dig it. It speaks my vibe. <laughs> I hope it speaks your vibe too, because I swear, if you've ever played Smash, and this is no different than Smash, it just has this. One will win, many will lose aspect to it. It's a damn shame this game has never got out over here in the States. It would have it would made quite the um It would have hit all the right vibes. But that is for another time. So, this was a look at Hudson's most obscurest fighter ever known. Dream Mix TV World Fighters. So, until next time, whatever I plan on doing, I've been your host. PI7 and this was a look at Dream Mix TV World Fighters from the Hudson The Best Collection. So, see you next time with another crazy episode of The Chess of Obscurity. So with that, let's see before we leave. We didn't unlock anything. So yeah, see you next time.